hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you a new tool that i developed here which is vue.js pdf editor which basically have this visivic editor here you can write anything here and all these controls are there for formatting purposes you can do these formatting here and we have built this tool inside js pdf html to canvas and also we are using frola visivic editor inside vue.js so all these technologies we have used guys you will see we can highlight the text inside this visivic editor and we can change the text here to any color in the palette here and the nice thing is that guys we can do formatting as well we can place the text in the center position here at any position that you want we can bold the text as well so let's suppose if i want to bold this i can even do that and there are two options either we can export this using js pdf library if you do this guys the formatting will not be there it will open this the formatting will not be there and now if you do this using html to canvas html to pdf library guys the formatting will also be there you will see that it will place it at the center position here so i have written this source code with my full dedication guys you can get all the source code in the description of the video you can purchase the full source code so please support me i have written this source code from scratch inside vue.js the price is very reasonable and the nice thing is that guys you can also add images let's suppose if you want to add an image here you can place this image right here and now if you see your pdf document will be created right here the image will be added here so you can just choose your image file from the computer that you saved right here and also you can insert table as well guys so instantly you can have the table as well right here you can see that we can add uh, basically you can have uh, inside this dialog window you can just control the width of the table let's suppose if i change to 50 width so now the table width will change here you will see that now it has become right this so all these options are there guys insert column right here you can see that and there is also the option to close this so delete table we don't so once again you can add this table guys so let's suppose if you want to add table properties you will see control the properties of the table you can also provide the border color to the table guys background color you can change of the table so if i say you can see the background color of the table will change here and then you can place the entries here name age so any sort of entry you can create guys so let's suppose i say so now if you export this table guys automatically inside your pdf document this table will be added here so i think it's a pretty good tremendous pdf editor guys that i developed in this uh, tutorial so please purchase this if you want to you can deploy this tool in the browser because the nice thing is that i am just executing it in the browser so this tool that you, you after purchasing it you can earn money from google adsense or ezoic you can just purchase it at a very reasonable price and then you can have your own domain name and deploy this tool in seconds so after you purchase the source code guys you will have this directory structure right here this is view view js and basically guys we have used all these dependencies which is html to canvas html to pdf.js js pdf ql uh, which is visivic editor we are also using this uh, frola visivic editor tiny mce ck editor so all these dependencies are built using uh, for building this uh, awesome little pdf editor guys so the nice thing is that you can add any sort of images you can i have shown you you can place this image in the center position at any position that you want here so you can underline your text here let's suppose if i want to underline this i can do underlining so let's suppose if i want to change the text color i can put any text color here so this is i think for the background color so yeah if you want to change its background color guys you need to first of all select this and then you can see the color has changed here so now let me change this to uh, text color to this so now you can also see guys basically you can also change the background color of the text as well so let's suppose if you want a different color to be have the background so here you can see that so if i see basically it will reflect the changes as well guys you will see the background color of the text is changed to red here so you can control each and every property guys so you can see the power of this editor you can basically design invoice elements 
you can design email templates inside PDF document. You can design CV, anything you can design using this Visivic PDF editor, guys, which basically converts your the HTML that it automatically generates into PDF document using HTML2 PDF library or JS PDF. So if you try JS PDF, guys, the formatting will not be great. So that's why I will recommend that you press the second button of which allows you to HTML2 PDF. So there are various options guys. You can preview this document right here. So it also provides you a preview, live preview window as well. So it's a dialog box window which provides you the live preview of the PDF document that you are generating right here. You will see that all the elements that you have placed inside the PDF document will be coming in the preview screen. This is a very useful feature. And then you can also design new documents. So as you click this new document guys, it will uh, reset everything. So now you can have previous document. You will also go to the uh, previous window guys using this undo feature. So you can see redo undo feature is also there. And we have also this feature of making the text italic underline. All these texts are there. Formatting options are there. Bulleting uh, dot symbol all that stuff. We can also embed image. Uh, I think uh, videos as well. We can embed videos as well, YouTube videos. So let's suppose if I want to embed this video, guys, I can also embed this video as well. So I simply need to click this option, put the source here, click save. So now this YouTube video will also place here, guys. But it will not come inside uh, the PDF document. Because video you can't play, that's why I think, yeah. So, I think this is basically the editor, guys. And page break, you can even add page break. And we have special character as well. So, you can add uh, currency symbols, text symbols, guys, also inside this. So, let's suppose if you are uh, adding dollar symbol, you can even add dollar symbol as well. So, if you have special symbols that you want to add inside your PDF document, quotation, text, it can be any special symbol. You can see that all special symbols are supported right here. So you can search for your special character, currency symbols. Most of the popular currencies are there. You will see that. So it's basically controls a very good, you can see if I export this, you can see that these currency symbols have been successfully added so the power you can just imagine guys the possibilities are endless while you can basically use this we have also the full screen mode as well guys you can have the full screen and then we have the preview as well with this button you can preview your pdf document and then we have got you can insert images from the url as well and you can even in the uh, no templates defined so if you want to embed templates you can undo all this stuff you can do guys view we also have the source code guys so let's suppose if you only want the source code so it automatically generates the source code of the pdf document right here so it has all these features right pre-built so it took a lot of time guys for me to write this code so please support me by purchasing if you like this you can deploy this tool on your own website and uh, then we can even Im embed a code sample as well so let's suppose you can choose any code sample let's suppose you can choose python language so here you can just say print statement let me want to print it i can say hello world so you can embed any sort of source code as well guys so let's suppose you will see that source code will be added right here print hello world and now if i s see guys you will see that that source code will be added right here print hello world so basically guys you can even embed source code inside your pdf document as well so all these formatting options are supported line height font sizes you can control text color clear formatting all these options you can control it also tell you the number of words that are present inside this guys it is 13 characters also character limit it's very useful you can see that So you can even embed any sort of table like this, any sort of grid table that you can import guys. You can see how easy it is to embed tables. You can also see the table properties from this menu. So you can delete table. So 
this was the short little demo guys that I developed so if you are interested you can buy the source code the link is given in the description of the video so thank you very much for watching this video